guys i don't actually think you are ready for the stuff i am about to tell you in this video i don't think you're ready for the hot gist i'm about to share but please i know what you're about to say like which are we expecting more youtube content from you more youtube related content from you or are we still expecting lifestyle vlogs and personal experiences vlogs and documenting stuff about yourself well it's gonna have to be a be a mix of both like na collabo <laughs> well this is me on a personal journey um yeah this is my journey to discovering more stuff about you know youtube and you know this space basically and as i continue in this journey i come across some stuff that i want to share with you guys i want you to be on the same boat on the same space I want you guys to be on the same booth with me on this and i just can't keep it to myself now during the course of this journey i've embarked on the journey of you know discovery here on youtube and you know doing a lot of research and finding out what to expect in the year 2025 especially because 2024 is coming to an end guys it's wrapping up and for those of us that have decided that this is what we're going to be doing consistently and this is what we're going to be doing for fun for passion for the money and all what's not my dear it's better you do your own homework better you do your own assignment you need to know what to expect come 2025 and then i came across this video now this video was about the program that was held in new york named made on youtube 2024 now this program was amazing this program featured some of the biggest youtubers in the world and it also had the ceo of youtube right there and they were dishing out like hot information hot updates on features that we're supposed to expect in the year 2025 and guess what guys after watching after doing you know after watching you know you get all the information you also have to do further research right to build on what you've heard and what what to build on what i have heard and what i have come to know right i decided to set up my camera and do this video and i was like no no no, i'm not going to have this tea alone i'm going to share it with one or two or three percent as many people as watch this video till the end click on the like button share drop in the comment section if peradventure you've heard of any of these um updates anywhere if you're looking forward to any of the updates if you have you know something to share about it if you're expecting if you're expecting it enthusiastically or you don't look forward to it just let me know in the comment section below and if there are further things you also want to me to research for you let me know i think i have all the time right now in my hands to do all the homework i can do regarding youtube so anyway let's get right into the video most of the information that is landing on youtube is hot <laughs> it is hard. Now the first update is that the first update is that drum roll. So I'm looking to my left. Pardon, me, I'm looking to my left. I have my laptop right here, and I made some jotting. So I need to refer back to my laptop once in a while, but I'll still, you know, keep eye contact with you. Now let me state that a lot of things were shared during the program. A lot of updates, a lot of features. But I'm going to point out the the biggest ones or the highlights or let me say the ones that were the highlights for me and i will say for me because i'm a small youtuber and a growing youtuber and i feel like most of these updates are very very beneficial mostly to growing youtubers and small youtubers and so i highlighted these biggest updates and thought to share with you guys now there's this one called hype now from the name alone hype like it already sounds interesting it sounds motivating it sounds like a breath of fresh air right but let me tell you what hype is about hype basically gives your audience the power to help your content reach more people now you know before or okay before hype will come into play as a youtuber after creating content after editing after posting well you're expected to you know urge people to watch to share to like as it helps with your algorithm as it helps push your video right but this time the people watching your video would actually have the power to help your content reach more people now it's as simple as it has been said and it's beautiful now let that sink in first of all digest that information breathe in breathe out <laughs> now let me tell you how this feature works right now your audience will be able to hype your videos and your content now when your video is hyped it will increase the chance of it being pushed out to more people now this is literally giving your audience power this is literally the ability the, um, your audience having the ability to manipulate the algorithm 
as simple as that like your audience will be able to dictate how successful your channel becomes how successful each video that you put out becomes now majorly now in terms of this right this will actually work for you because your audience will not only <coughs> not only push your videos for you they will hype your video now kind of like a like or a super like you know something that it's ex something that's extra so now your audience have the power to hype your videos now, now these hypes are going to be counted as points hear this the hypes are going to be counted as points now the videos that have the most hype points your videos that have the most hype points are going to be featured on this special leaderboard and now this leader this your videos being on this leaderboard will increase their chances of being viewed by an entire new audience like a whole new audience now youtube has already been testing this feature they've tested they've, they've tested this high feature in brazil and turkey and in taiwan and it has had a very large success rate so far now it's amazing because that make these results have been telling youtube you know how people are pumped about this feature people are pumped people are excited and youtube already plans to expand this to more markets in the coming months and when we say the coming months you know it is flowing into 2025 now i want to start with this one because i feel like this one is going to be a game changer like it's going to be it is going to hit hard it's going to be that one feature that is going to you know give um small youtubers that that's relief that's how I, I don't know how to explain it but i'm sure that you watching me you understand what i mean and you know where i'm coming from and you know where i'm going to now the way they talk about the way they talked about this feature right i feel like it's going to be a way for people to spotlight rising stars on youtube people are going to be able to pick out okay this person is making you know great progress person is growing and it's just going to be an entire game changer for small youtubers now dropping this first update for you you need to keep your eyes peeled you need to keep focus you need to stay right on this update you don't want to be left slacking you don't want to be caught off guard because this is going to be a game changer like this is the real deal and if you thought hype was going to be the only like significant update then you are wrong because youtube is coming in hot with the next one now the next one is communities now a lot of us are already familiar with the community tab right it's a tab where you have it's a tab you have on your youtube channel which allows you to upload posts to, to upload text-based posts and it also allows you to share carousel photos right now you can do polls you can link to videos you can there's so many things you can do with your community tab right now it is basically another way for you to communicate with your audience beyond sharing your regular video content and your shorts and stuff now they are taking the community tab and they're taking it to the next level with communities now youtube is taking community tab and taking it to the next level with communities communities will not only allow you to share your content with your audience but it will also allow your audience to share content they are describing it as our very own corner of the internet like this is where your audience will be able to share photos and comments discuss the content you've already shared and basically connect with each other now i feel like this is beautiful because as a content creator it's important that even as they're putting out video content there's a form of communication be between you your audience it helps to form you know partnerships it helps with networking it helps to build a family and people you know get to know who you are get to know what to expect from your kind of from your personality right now it's not about you broadcasting your post out to everyone else and then responding to them with communities your audience will also be able to share content now i feel like if when you're really deep into these updates like when you really go into these updates you realize that it is very significant it has like it goes a long way for content creators because it's basically like you are merging all other social media sites all as in merging all of them on that youtube amazing mind-blowing right like making youtube an entire world of its own which it already is by the way now this next update is one of my absolute favorites like um from my background of being a tv girl and you know enjoying the absolute pleasure of of you know <clears throat> enjoying the absolute pleasure of having tv viewing experience here on youtube but last year youtube beat all other streaming platforms in terms of content viewed on tv now youtube hear this well youtube beat all other platforms in terms of content viewed on 
TV. Now, we, when we say TV, you know, we're talking about television, right? Now, but this was only in the US market, you know, that the US is pretty a big market. But then, it's mad, right? Like, it's crazy. And it basically means that the more hours of content, that more hours of content was watched on the TV from YouTube than any other streaming platform. Wild. Now, now let me tell you that this trend has just been increasing and increasing with time. Now, what YouTube are presently doing and looking for ways to enhance their TV viewing experience to facilitate even more hours of content being watched on the TV. Now, if you're watching this video right now on the TV, please, can you comment below? Like, if you're watching my video right now on TV, please drop a comment below and let me know that, yeah, you're watching it on TV. So, there are a few ways they're enhancing this experience. One way is to make links easier for people to follow when they are watching from the TV. For example, they plan on automatically turning video links into QR codes, like video links that are in the description box in videos they turn into QR codes so that people can scan the QR codes on their phone and follow a link now I'm excited about that one like I'm so so excited about it now they're looking to create a more immersive experience for example when you go on a creator's YouTube channel and there and instead of there to be, just be a video playing instead of there to just be the channel banner rather there's going to be a video playing automatically instead of their usual channel banner on the creator's channel now just to make the whole experience a little more or a lot more immersive the final updates that they are making to the um, tv viewing experience that i'm most excited about is that they are giving creators the ability to sort their content into seasons and episodes it's as good as any creator becoming a movie producer or a movie or a movie maker or filmmaker rather or a movie producer like you're able to sort your content into seasons into episodes for a better tv viewing experience like this is so amazing this is so heartwarming it hits me at the right spot if you're a content creator potentially like me just get this for me that this is an opportunity for you to have your own content series or show your con or sh uh, content series or show on your channel easy peasy right now, now the next update i want to talk about is what to do with your inspiration tab your inspiration tab you guys already hopefully you know about this tab if you've watched content there are a lot of content on youtube here that talk about the inspiration tab you can do your research your further research you can watch videos on it you need to understand that you can find it in your analytics and it is designed to give you content topics and inspiration that you can use for your future videos they're going to be giving the inspiration tab a complete makeover and they're of course utilizing ai in order to do it now this is amazing this is beautiful there's one good thing about YouTube. It only gets better. It can only get better. It keeps moving and moving forward. Now, one of the ways you'll be able to use the inspiration tab in the future that you can't currently use it um, for right now is that the tab is not only to find content ideas for your channel, but you're also able to get outlines for your videos. It's amazing, right? Now, these outlines will be automatically generated using AI. As always, Please, when you're using this feature, also exercise caution because, you know, AI, you know, has its, has its ups and downs and has its downsides, especially. So you need to be very, very cautious when using this particular tool or feature. You want to always make sure that the content you're creating is unique to you. It has your own personality and your own tone of voice in it. It doesn't, you don't just go, you know, blindly um adopting scripts or outlines generated by ai without injecting a bit of you a bit of the natural you your content creativity into it right now this next update is dubbing now if you're not familiar with dubbing already it's a process of translating your content so that people who speak other languages can understand it i hear a round of applause i hear a round of applause <laughs> now this process like i said will translate your content in whatever language you have already you know filmed it in translate to other languages so that people who don't understand the language you're speaking in that particular video or vlog so that they can understand your content now previously um big creators but big youtubers like mr beast for example you know he would spend thousands and hire a lot of people to hire people to translate his content for him record their audio and then overlay it over his youtube videos like it was an entire 
you know, scheme of work already to do that. Now, that was previously how it was being done. I know some other, you know, big YouTubers will go through that, you know, that will go through that process to make sure that their videos appeal to every language or most languages, depending on where they are. Now, however, you will soon be able to do that using auto-dubbing on YouTube. Auto-dubbing is one of the features they're about to release come 2025. Now, at the moment, you guessed it right. Yes, it's already being tested, like all other features I've talked about today. It's currently being tested with a handful of creators, but uh, they are hoping to expand this to more creators soon. And in addition to expanding its access, they are also hoping to expand the amount of languages that it currently supports from Spanish to Portuguese to French. Now, it's supposed to like please everyone. For us here in this part of the world, Nigeria, I can't definitely, I can't definitely assure you that they're going to add Igbo language, Yoruba, Hausa, Efikurubu, uh, as in Tiv and all the languages that we have here in Nigeria. But then I'm talking about spot on countries, I'm talking about countries that are not even English speaking. At least here in Nigeria, we are English speaking. So I think this is where I'm going to stop with all the updates so far that I have. You know, done my research about i'm going to draw the curtains here not that i'm going to stop creating youtube audits kind of videos right but then for now <laughs> this is all i have right here on my um notepad this is what i have so far and honestly honestly it has been exciting going through this journey i was genuinely taken aback by how big these updates are like these updates hit close to home when i say they hit close to home they are uh, there are updates that are going to make us feel us creators. When I say us, I'm talking about me and you as creators. Make us feel like YouTube is really thinking about us, really thinking of how to make work easier. Yes, I call this work because a lot of content creators, you know, live and die by what you know YouTube brings forth to the table, right? So this shows us that youtube is thinking about us youtube got us <laughs> and as creators well you know we got youtube as well it's not like we have a choice now having watched this video and hearing all of these wonderful updates i would love to hear your thoughts on this i'd love to hear what you think really about these updates if you're looking forward to any of them or if there's anyone in particular they're looking forward to you can't wait to you know play around with you can't wait to have as a content creator on now, if as an audience you are also um, happy for creators like us and there are particular updates that you really look forward to and um, to experiencing just let me know in the comment section thank you for watching this video it's been absolutely amazing doing all the research filming this video and editing it and then posting it for you to watch right please give this video a thumbs up if you like it and share it to other creators and other creator communities that you belong to and you want them to you know get hint of this update so that they are anticipating earlier on and not where 2025 hit everybody's wondering where to go left or right here on youtube and i'll see you in the next one thanks for watching